Okay, let's look at this team. Uh, Drapion, uh, Lolan, Persian, Hydragon, Sharpedo. Oh, this is definitely an all dark team. Um, fucking Incineroar and Greninja. Okay, so uh, this was probably not the team to bring Mega Metagross. Ha. Huh. Okay. Fuck. Um. I don't know who to start with. What else to do with this? Alright, come on, media player. Fucking catch up, everybody. Oh. Should probably confirm. Whoops. Whoops. But wow, I am bad in a thousand today. Ugh, alright. Readjusted here. Grunkle Stan, who the fuck? Oh, Drapion, oh boy. It is your boy, Guzma. It is, in fact, your boy. Okay, I think I want to get some rocks up. Oh, God, Toxic Spikes, great. Yeah, no, that's fine. Well, at least it only affects the mods that are touching the ground, so... Yeah, we're definitely going to be trading hazards here. Let's see. What do you do from here? I feel like I have an idea of what you do. I should do this. Double Toxic Spikes, you motherfucker! Uh, let's get a U-turn going. Pressure of Earthquake. I could, I could have fucking just. See, I was predicting that you were gonna switch because you figured that maybe I wouldn't let you live after the first layer of Toxic Spikes. So I thought you were gonna predict the Earthquake and switch into High Dragon to make me waste an Earthquake. That's why I went with that. Um. So, uh, that definitely did not fucking pan out how I wanted it to. Ah, god damn it! The toxic spikes take effect before the misty terrain does. Shit. Well, that did not work as I planned. Let's do this. Man, I was in trouble here. I mean, I had to get the Misty Terrain up. Just to prevent my ground monster from being double fucking poisoned. Oh, here comes a knockoff. Unfortunate. And at least you took some rough skin damage. So that's good. Oh, and you have lefties. Excellent. No oh, fucking Black Sludge. Same difference. Same difference. That was probably a bad play. On my part. Because probably now you're bringing out High Dragon. Yup. Mm hmm. Fuck me. Okay. Um. Well, this is not short. The, the only good thing about me not being choice scarfed is that. Um. I know I naturally outspeed this thing unless it's scarfed. So are you gonna be are you gonna be scarfed? Because I'm pretty sure Garchomp like naturally outspeeds fucking High Dragon. So I don't know, man. Yeah, I'm fairly certain that fucking um Garchomp naturally outspeeds High Dragon. I don't remember High Dragon's base speed, but I'm pretty sure it's not 102. Alright, calm down. Town Siren telling me it's 6 o'clock. 
Hey, C. Williams, welcome to the stream. How you doing? Um, my week's been alright. I'm just gonna find out in about half a second if you are in fact scarfed. So that you know that Dark Pulse is not gonna do a lot. Yep, I think you're scarfed. Oh my god! With this siren! Can you not? Jesus H. Christ. Could you fucking not? Hang on, I'm gonna turn my mic off. Okay then! Fuck. <laughs> Man, this might be a mistake, but let's see how it goes. No, we're going for knockoff, okay? Get rid of my lefties. Yeah, the siren is done now. Yeah, sorry, my town likes to fucking inform everyone it's 6 o'clock by playing this really loud-ass siren. It only happens on Wednesdays, though, thankfully. Right, this was definitely a mistake. I lived it, though. I don't think I'm gonna live the poison at the end of the turn. Which is the really unfortunate thing there. We just got rid of this fucking Drapion, though. Piss me off. Okay, there we go. And down goes Ursula. Okay. I can't see any reason for doing that. I know, right? What the fuck? Let me go over Dragon Pulse. Oh boy, this might kill. This might kill. Uh, okay, no it doesn't. No it doesn't. Right, there goes that dragon. This fucking team, though, is giving me so much fucking... It's giving me such a fucking headache. I honestly don't know who to bring out here. I'm just gonna bring out Mumbo Jumbo, just because. I don't think Mumbo Jumbo does a lot in this battle anyway, if I'm honest. He's probably like the one Pokemon that's super weak to most things on this team. In fact, it's super weak to that hot puss, are you fucking serious? Ah, jeez. Um, yeah, Mumbo Jumbo's not gonna do a lot, considering it is weak to, oh, I don't know, every mod on this team. Because Ghost is weak to Dark. So, go for Sword Stance. Ooh, this could be my chance. This could be my chance right here to take out this Incineroar. Because this also is going to be a really big threat to Metagross. So if I can get rid of you now. Yep, there we go. Boomerang's going to do it. Alright, Mumble Jumbo putting in at least a little bit of work. That sick Boomerang, though. And right, there goes the Mist. Now all my Grounded Mods are going to get fucking badly poisoned on the Switch in, so hopefully I don't have to do a lot of switching. Well, all my ground mods except for Metagross, because it's, uh, Steel-type. Oh, wow, Sharpedo is definitely gonna fuck my shit up. And it's not great. That's literally all I can fucking do at this point. 
Ah, for fuck's sake, when Bell spot my aura Curio hasn't found his glasses yet. <laughs> ah. It's probably gonna be Mega Sharpedo, which I'm not happy about. Yep. It's the usual Sharpedo strat. You protect on the first turn to get this, the guaranteed plus one speed, and then you basically run over everything on the opposing team as you outspeed most, if not all of it. Uh, yeah, no, I wasn't gonna live. I was a crit as well. I know you weren't. I know you didn't have any added attacks, so hopefully that didn't fucking. Like, I'm hoping that crit mattered. Because I almost feel like I could have maybe lived it with a, a sliver of HP and gotten a bone meringue off. But, I don't know. Oh, maybe I'm talking out my ass there. Just trying to. Just trying to make excuses. What do you have left? You have your Greninja, which we haven't seen yet. Your Alolan Persian, which we haven't seen yet. And the Sharpedo, which is currently fucking my shit up. I can go for the waterfall, okay. Uh, not even half. And you're gonna take Rocky Helmet damage, so as long as I don't flinch. As I fucking say it. Okay, well. You're a drunk Sharpedo now, so you're gonna lose that plus one speed, thankfully for me. Here comes the Alolan Persian. And this thing's probably gonna be really defensively bulky, so don't know how much I'm actually gonna be able to do here. Yeah, look at that. Look at that nothing. Look how much that stab earthquake did. Jesus Christ. Oh, parting shot. Yep. So you're gonna lower my attack and my special attack by one stage and force your uh, Persian to switch out. Why can't I use caps? Because uh, Moobot does not like caps. Alright, ooh, here comes the Greninja. This could actually work out. This could actually work out slightly well in my favor. Because I just use U turn. So even at reduced damage, that's still gonna do quite a bit. So. We're gonna go into No Attack here. I know he's gonna get double poisoned, I know he's gonna get bad poison. But, I know as regular Greninja, I'm definitely going to outspeed you, being that I am Ashgren right now. So I feel like the best course of action would be this. Oh, you're going to move over Shuriken, okay. As long as this doesn't kill. No, it's not going to come close. Even if you get five hits, you have to crit like every single one in order to get anywhere near enough. No talks get a U-turn. It's gonna take care of your Greninja. Goodbye. Unfortunately, we still have that fucking Sharpedo left. And the Alolan Persian, actually, so... It's not great, but... Hopefully Calrissian can take care of business here. Hey, Strike Down 131. Uh, type exclamation point battle to learn how the battles work. Basically, it's by a raffle, and it's not gonna be open again until this battle list is cleared. So, uh, it'll still be a little bit yet, but, uh... Hang out, and you'll have a chance to battle a little bit later on. Okay. Now so we got Sharpedo out here. Of course, Sharpedo came in after the switch initiative from U-Turn happened, so I didn't get the minus one attack, which is really annoying. Right, here's what we'll do. Yeah, Street Shark's gonna get the poison. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But Waterfall's definitely gonna... It's probably gonna take me out, because that's neutral. But you are gonna get rough skin damage. Yeah, honestly, I don't think Shark... I don't think, um... Uh, fucking Street Shark does much in this battle, anyway. Not at this point. Calrissian, on the other hand, is gonna get that minus one attack drop, which is the only reason I lived the last Waterfall. So, um, yeah. Gonna need that. Yeah, there goes Sharpedo back in the Alolan friggin' Persian. Which thankfully is taking rock damage on every switch in, so that's good. At least, you know, take some comfort in that. Alright, nice. You should be weak enough now that there's no way you live anything that my Metagross does. 
And thankfully, again, Metagross is not going to get poisoned because of its steel typing, which is always nice. Yeah, you should definitely not live anything I do at this point. Provided I don't miss, I should be fine. So I'm pretty sure I outspeed you, so you shouldn't be able to get a parting shot off. Don't miss. Good. When I get the attack buff, that'd be even better. Nice! Ha <laughs> ha! Beautiful. Alright. We just gotta take care of Sharpedo now. It's gonna take more rock damage on the way in. And the only hope it has is if it crunches and kills in the first turn. So I don't really foresee that happening. But I'm not gonna get my hopes up too high. Because worse things have happened before. But even if Sharp even if Mega Metagross goes down, I feel like I feel like no attack and Calrissian in a conjoined effort could, well, I guess I outspeed you anyway, so it doesn't matter. Goodbye. And GG. Was gonna Z parting shot? Oh, oh, that would have been really annoying. Would have fully restored uh, Mega Sharpedo's health and got the attack drops. Or it outspeeds, yeah, fucking Mega Metagross is fucking fast, dude. Gets like base 110 speed.